Apple's developer site has been down since Thursday. Now the tech company is finally explaining why it's been hacked. The company says an intruder attempted to access secure information on the server and may have gotten access to some less delicate information like emails, addresses and names. The Guardian reports a Turkish security researcher has taken responsibility for the hack, but he insists his intention was to only alert Apple its system was leaking user information. Apple has not confirmed who hacked the system, but Apple told Macworld the breach was not associated with any customer information, nor did the hacker have access to app code or the servers where app information is stored. Apple has been hacked before, but the more serious issue this time, VentureBeat explains, is that the hack wasn't targeted on the client side. The fear is, if an attacker can penetrate Apple's security in places like the developer site, they may also be able to access the signing credential technology that keeps iPhone apps malware free. And according to VentureBeat, the last thing Apple wants is for its iPhone buying public to consider the iOS ecosystem malware laden. The outage set off quite a few concerns, especially since this comes as Apple gears up for two new releases of iOS and OS X. CNET explains developers have been updating their software for these versions, which Apple says will be released in the fall. Apple plans to completely rebuild the developer database, update server software, and overhaul the site, but there's been no projected date set for when the site will be up and running again. For Newsy, I'm Micah Sargent, Multiple Sources, A Broader View.